Welcome to World in Two Minutes. These are your headlines. Police have raided the house of the former president in connection with the ongoing Petrobras scandal. Police say they obtained more than 30 search warrants and 11 detention warrants for the raid. They've also recently arrested several other politicians. The scandal involves more than $20 billion worth of suspicious contracts. Luis Inacio Lula da Silva denies involvement. The UN has criticised the EU for warning asylum seekers not to come to Europe. On Thursday, the President of the European Council, Donald Tusk, said I want to appeal to all potential illegal economic migrants, wherever you are from, do not come to Europe. But the UN says most people arriving in Europe are fleeing war and that 91% of people going to Greece are from Syria, Iraq and Afghanistan. More than 25,000 people are stranded at Greece's border with Macedonia. The UN's High Commissioner for Human Rights has warned that the FBI could open a Pandora's box if it forces Apple to give it data from an iPhone. The tech giant has contested the FBI's order to create software to unlock an iPhone used by one of the San Bernardino attackers last year. That shooting killed 14 people. But the High Commissioner, Zayed Rad Al Hussein, says if the FBI has its way, it would make it impossible for Apple or any other major international IT company to protect their clients' privacy anywhere in the world. The grizzly bear may soon lose its status as a threatened species. The US Fish and Wildlife Service says the bear population in Yellowstone National Park has risen from 136 to 700 in the last 40 years. Several states in the region have lobbied to have the grizzly removed from the list of endangered and threatened animals. This would allow it to be hunted. Some conservationists say it's too soon for such a move. Thanks for watching. TRTWorld.com, Istanbul.